Do you want to transform your look from boy to girl for a birthday party? Whether you are a crossdresser, a transgender woman, or just someone who likes to play with makeup, you can achieve a stunning feminine appearance with some makeup skills and products. In this video, we will show you how to do boy to girl makeup for a birthday party and give you some tips and tricks to make it easier and more fun. If you identify as a woman or you have a feminine side that you want to express, makeup can be a great way to do that. Makeup can help you enhance your natural features, create a more feminine shape and contour, and express your personality and style. You can also use makeup to match your outfit, your mood, or the theme of the party. Now that you know why you might want to try boy-to-girl makeup for a birthday party, let's see how to do it. Here are the steps that you need to follow. Step 1. Prepare your skin. The first step to do boy-to-girl makeup is to prepare your skin. This will help you create a smooth and flawless face for your makeup, and also improve the health and appearance of your skin. Before you apply any makeup, you need to cleanse, exfoliate, and moisturize your skin. This will remove any dirt, oil, and dead skin cells that can clog your pores and make your makeup look cakey. Use a gentle cleanser that suits your skin type, and massage it into your skin with circular motions. Rinse with warm water and pat dry with a soft towel. Next. Use a gentle exfoliator that can remove any stubble or ingrown hairs that can ruin your makeup. Scrub your skin gently with circular motions, and rinse with warm water. Finally, apply a moisturizer that suits your skin type, and massage it into your skin until it is fully absorbed. This will hydrate and nourish your skin, and make it more plump and smooth. After you have cleansed, exfoliated, and moisturized your skin, you need to apply primer and concealer. Primer is a product that can help your makeup last longer, and also smooth out any pores, fine lines, or texture on your skin. Concealer is a product that can help you cover any blemishes, dark circles, or redness on your skin, and also brighten and even out your skin tone. Choose a primer and a concealer that match your skin type and tone, and apply them with your fingers, a makeup sponge, or a brush. Apply primer all over your face, and blend it well. Apply concealer under your eyes, around your nose, on your chin, and on any other areas that need extra coverage. Blend it well with your fingers, a makeup sponge, or a brush. Step 2. Apply foundation and powder. The next step to do boy-to-girl makeup is to apply foundation and powder. Foundation is a product that can help you create a flawless and uniform complexion, and also add some color and warmth to your skin. Powder is a product that can help you set your foundation, and also mattify and smooth your skin. Choose a foundation and a powder that match your skin type and tone, and apply them with a makeup sponge or a brush. Apply foundation all over your face, and blend it well with a makeup sponge or a brush. Make sure to blend it down your neck and ears, and avoid any harsh lines or streaks. Apply powder all over your face, and blend it well with a makeup sponge or a brush. Make sure to use a light hand, and avoid any cakey or powdery look. Step 3. Enhance your eyes. The third step to do boy-to-girl makeup is to enhance your eyes. Your eyes are one of the most important features of your face, and they can make a big difference in your overall look. You can use eyeshadow, eyeliner, and mascara to make your eyes look bigger, brighter, and more feminine. Before you apply any eye makeup, you need to shape and fill your eyebrows. Your eyebrows can frame your face, and also define and balance your eyes. You can use tweezers, scissors, or a razor to trim and shape your eyebrows, and follow your natural arch and shape. You can also use an eyebrow pencil, powder, or gel to fill in any gaps or sparse areas in your eyebrows, and make them look fuller and more defined. Choose an eyebrow product that matches your natural hair color, and apply it with light and short strokes. Blend it well with a spoolie brush, and avoid any harsh or unnatural look. After you have shaped and filled your eyebrows, you can apply eyeshadow, eyeliner, and mascara. Eyeshadow is a product that can help you add some color and dimension to your eyelids, and also create different effects and moods. Eyeliner is a product that can help you define and accentuate your eyes, and also create different shapes and styles. Mascara is a product that can help you lengthen and volumize your eyelashes, and also make your eyes look more open and awake. Choose an eyeshadow palette that suits your eye color, skin tone, and the theme of the party, and apply it with a brush or your fingers. 
You can use a light color on your brow bone, a medium color on your lid, and a dark color on your crease and outer corner. Blend the colors well with a brush or your fingers, and avoid any harsh lines or patches. Choose an eyeliner that suits your eye shape, size, and color, and apply it with a pencil, a liquid, or a gel. You can use a black or brown eyeliner for a natural and classic look, or a colorful or glittery eyeliner for a fun and festive look. You can apply eyeliner on your upper lash line, lower lash line, waterline, or wing it out for a cat eye look. Make sure to apply eyeliner close to your lash line, and avoid any gaps or smudges. Choose a mascara that suits your lash type, length, and volume, and apply it with a wand or a brush. You can use a black or brown mascara for a natural and subtle look, or a colorful or glittery mascara for a bold and dramatic look. You can apply mascara on your upper and lower lashes, and wiggle the wand or brush from the roots to the tips. Make sure to apply mascara evenly, and avoid any clumps or flakes. Step 4. Add some color to your cheeks and lips. The final step to do boy-to-girl makeup is to add some color to your cheeks and lips. Your cheeks and lips can add some life and freshness to your face, and also complete your look. You can use blush and lipstick to make your cheeks and lips look more rosy and plump. Before you apply any blush and lipstick, you need to choose a flattering blush and lipstick. Your blush and lipstick should suit your skin tone, eye color, and the theme of the party. You can use a pink, peach, or coral blush and lipstick for a natural and sweet look, or a red, berry, or plum blush and lipstick for a bold and sexy look. You can also use a matte, satin, or glossy finish for your blush and lipstick, depending on your preference and the occasion. After you have chosen a flattering blush and lipstick, you need to apply them with a light hand. Blush and lipstick can help you add some color and warmth to your face. But too much can make you look clownish or overdone. Use a brush or your fingers to apply blush on the apples of your cheeks, and blend it well with circular motions. Use a lip brush or your fingers to apply lipstick on your lips, and blend it well with gentle strokes. You can also use a lip liner to outline and define your lips, and a lip gloss to add some shine and moisture to your lips. In conclusion, you have learned how to do boy-to-girl makeup for a birthday party, and also some tips and tricks to make it easier and more fun. You have learned why you might want to try boy-to-girl makeup, how to prepare your skin, how to apply foundation and powder, how to enhance your eyes, how to add some color to your cheeks and lips, how to use a makeup sponge or brush, how to use a setting spray or powder, and how to experiment with different colors and styles. By following these steps and tips, you can transform your look from boy to girl for a birthday party, and impress yourself and others with your stunning feminine appearance.